Alrighty, MCP Week 8 regular season finals going up against Hayes. We're locked for playoffs. He needs to 6 0 us to make playoffs, so he's not making playoffs. Um, if he were to make playoffs, I imagine he would want to play for a 6 0. And playing for a 6 0 probably means trying to 6 0 with like a belly drum G Darm or like a setup, um, setup variant of like an Incineroar or something. Um, I have Aqua Jet Basculin as insurance against Darm. I have. Um, I, like Aqua Jet Bass, <laughs> I don't really know. It could be scary. Uh, I've liked Lead Thundy. Uh, it seems really solid. Uh, scares his team. Oh, he has No Nido King. No Nido King is cool. Um, my Chansey doesn't really serve that much of a purpose this game. It is like okay for Dragon, uh, for Dragapult, but it doesn't really do anything back. Um, so it just kind of ports, facilitates, which is fine, but like it's very, very, uh, Useless. Not useless, but, like, expendable. That's the word I'm looking for. Um, but, yeah. Good luck and fun to Hayes. Uh, winning here would put us against either... Um, either... Who? Um, we either get Dr. Slacking or whoever ends up in... Unless, like, Hayes 6 us. Uh, so I don't know. Maybe I'm giving up too much info on other games. Cool. This is fine. Lead Ensign. We're going to scare him with Defiant, right? Like, I figured it was cool to have. Right? Because now he's afraid. He's like, holy shit. Bop. Alrighty. I'm feeling good. We were in the La Agency merch. Full blue suit. I got a lot of this stuff. Um, I just like Thunderbolting here. Seems like free-ish. Free-ish enough. And then, like, we could Dark Pulse an incoming Delmise afterwards. Or, like... Chansey on Pult, we could do... We just get a Thunderbolt off on this. He party shots. Okay, so that's even more Defiance, which is really funny. Unfortunately, I'm not physical. But... If I have, like, a physical move, he has to be, like, terrified, right? Because this is plus four. Um, Not that I think he would. But, like, you gotta be afraid of, like, a superpower or something, or, like, a knockoff. I wish I had knockoff now. Or, like, superpower, you know. Would have just bopped this instant if I went physical. There's G-Darm. On G-Darm, I have options between Fini or Zama, which puts him at a 50-50, where it's like Earthquake is his best mid-ground, but if Earthquake is his... I, he, he's just clicking a U-turn, is what I'm trying to say. I'll go into my, uh... What lets in a scarier Pokemon? I feel like... I feel like Feeny is fine. It's higher upside. For sure. Worst case, Delmise comes in, and I'm into my Zalma regardless. Um, and we're Rest Hog Zalma this week. I think this is our first time bringing it all season. But Stabs was very, very fine this week. He subs up. Yeah, I knew this was coming. I knew this was coming, boys. Um, cool. Draining Kiss should break sub. If it doesn't, well then. If he's non Salak or if he messes up his HP. I hope Draining Kiss breaks. Holy fuck, I might have just like lost. I might have just lost and tossed. Okay, thank god. Thank god, thank god. Okay. I sack Chansey here. It's useless. Um, and then I can revenge with Jet Basculin. Thank God Zen Mode acts at the end of the turn. Yeah. I sack Chansey here. Had that not broken, I assume the sub would have been in shard range at the very least, and then I would have been fine regardless. But, yeah. Chansey's fine to go. He just EQs. Yeah, that's fine. I figured Chansey would be my least useful member here. If I can preserve, like, a fully healthy Tapu Fini. And I just go Basculin or Aqua Jet. Don't want to fuck around with this thing. I sent Haze a Basculin. That did not have Aqua Jet on it. But this one does. <laughs> this one does. Hopefully he just stays in. He preserves his 25% Darm. That's fine. There's Pult. That's fine. 
because now the Dharma is not as scary. It's still very fast and very strong, but it doesn't have the speed boost, doesn't have the, uh, doesn't have the attack boost. Thank God that I made that change. Um, I'll go back into my Feeny. He U-turns, he U-turns, it's fine. I figured Jet was very much worth having um, for that exact reason. Okay, cool. We kill one Pokemon and we're very fine. So he has to, like, light screen. Is he, like, doing things? Is he doing things? I'm just going to try to set up and win my Feeny right now. Um, Iron Defense first. And then... Because, like, Iron Defense is probably a higher, higher word play. Ideally, he would throw off a Wisp. He thunders me. Ooh, shit. He brought Thunder. That is more damage than I would have liked to take. And he gets the Para. And I get fully Parried. Oh, uh, that's unfortunate. Man's really went all out. <laughs> um, hmm. I expected Physical because I have Chansey. Oh, Mammo, it's fine. It's fine, it's fine. Um, yeah, I'm fine, right? Just stay calm. I'll kill things eventually. Mamoswine kills things every time, actually. Um. Yeah, okay, he Shadow Balls. Um, you're not going to take a shard. You're not staying in for a shard. I'm in an Earthquake, predicting Keldeo. If you stay in and take a shard, that's kind of great. Okay, yeah, cool. Keldeo. Yeah, he has to preserve the 6L. He has to play for it, too. Your Balloon Keldeo. Okay. He brought it. Um, he did bring it. Oh, fuck, dude. Fuck, dude. I can force a kill. I can force a kill. If I force one kill, his season's over. And if he plays the 6-0, that's a very, very, like, it's a strong play. Um, strong player. He flips, too. Um, I knew that was coming. Like, ah, oh, damn. This sucks. This really sucks. Because now Delmice comes out. Delmice comes out, it's free Zama. And Zama pushes a lot of progress. Like, I'm fine. Delmines comes out, I can Behemoth Bash. I'll be fine. If I can't get a kill with this team, I don't know what I'm doing with anything. Pull, yeah. He goes pull. R slash hole up. So I imagine you're both screens with Shadow Ball and Thunder. But there went the light screen. I can pivot Zama once. Right? So you're not light clay. You probably Shadow Ball, maybe you Thunder. You light screen again. Okay. That's fine. You can't Wisp me. I'm just gonna have Behemoth Bash. It's very, very free mid ground. You could reflect up too, but like, I don't know if you're even gonna be both screens. You swap, that's fine. Delmise. Yeah, that's... I'm the Delmise counterplay on my team, so... This is fine. This is damage and a half. Yeah, cool. How are you gonna preserve a 6-0 now, buddy? That was a crit. That... That's unfortunate. <laughs> um, that might have just... Your eject button. You get back into something else... Your Delmise is low. Um, we're making progress, like, slowly, but surely. It's made, It's being made. The endgame Thunderous is what's being opened up heavily. Um, we need the Darmanitan gone. It can obviously revenge us, but... Yeah, imagine if I was just like a Chad and I just hard T-bolted the Darm as it subbed and then it couldn't drum on me. That would have been funny. Then it wouldn't have been a threat. Keldeo comes out. I like live a Keldeo hits. And like, breaking Balloon probably isn't hard worth it yet. 
you can just flip turn, but like it's fine. Feeny's doing things, it's doing stuff, and it's doing things. Um, plus you could call me out here with like a fighting move, I imagine, is something you're considering doing. Yeah, you are, okay. Um, cool, what's the pivot in to me? I don't know exactly, but I think I should drain and kiss, try to get a little bit of health back, some health going. You just flip, yeah, okay, that's fine. You obviously cannot let me break your balloon anytime soon, but eventually it will get popped when I can, if Incineroar or Registeel ever claims a kill, it becomes a 50-50 on if I can pop the balloon or not. There's the Registeel, I might be able to set up on you, I think I can. Unless you're Stoss. If you're Stoss, you're Stoss. And I need Chip on this thing anyways. So I'll go for an Iron Defense. If you're Stoss, you're Stoss. Mist is gone, but we're paired anyways. Um, yeah. You're a substitute on a Registeel. Subtox? It's fine. Ah, okay. I would like to not be paralyzed on these turns where I'm trying to set up, but, oh yeah, light screen's up. Now it's not. What is Registeel doing to me? Iron Defense. I'm also trying to Iron Defense up with you, so we should be fine. If only I had, if I had this last turn, then the 1v1 was, like, incredibly free. But I still have lefties to, like, keep me in it, and his body presses can't do too, too much over time. Um, and I tend to keep him, like, relatively low, but Feeny can't just win raw right now if he's, like, very insistent on setting up with this. Zap cannon? Okay. Sure. But now you have to hit two zap cannons in it. Okay, sure. You still have to hit another zap cannon. So it's in my best interest to calm mind. Um, yeah, for sure in my best interest to calm mind. Yeah, because you miss. And if I just don't get blunder policy? Okay, man's crazy. But now it's like, I'm fine, not to a KO'd. Um, not KO'd from the range that I'm at. This set makes like no sense, I will not lie. I imagine you're like body press last move, but I need to drain a little bit of health at least. The yeah, iron defenses again. Draining kiss is fine, it'll like get me somewhere. I don't know what exactly the setup war is doing. Okay, I am just getting like full paired like every other turn, which sucks. Like, this is terrible. I think my Paraluck is worse than average. I need to Iron Defense again. I think. Yeah. Come on, let's go, Feeny. So this is effectively plus four into, or plus six into plus four is like effectively less than plus one iron defense that's gonna come off on me. But like obviously I can get crit and I will get crit knowing how this game has been like played. Yeah. Okay. Cool. And now we're just playing a risky game. I think it's in my best interest to try to, like, draining kiss still a little bit more. Um, but obviously stored power does, like, kind of rack up in power. But potentially. Yeah. Draining kiss. I'm just, like, I'm looking for any amount of health. Cool. 
that does not do enough where it's worth draining kissing again. It's probably worth throwing off one calm mind and then reassessing. Zap cannons, okay. But, yeah, this set is weird. I just have to keep in mind that he's still like plus four or plus six defense. So if my Feeny goes, this could be scary. But it's a plus two Reggie Steel. I don't even know how fast that is. Yeah, it's definitely a draining kiss line here. I think I'll live a body press. He connects his app cannon. But we live. Hopefully, we, if we break sub, we're fine. I don't know if we do. We don't. We might be getting cheesed by a Reggie Steel. <sighs> this is weird. How do you hit so many Zap Cannons? What the hell? Oh, we live. Cool. Goat. Okay, cool. I'm just gonna store power now, which should be breaking subs, as this should break his sub. Thank God. Um, and then store power should be breaking subs. In case he wants to like try to go crazy on me, and then we just have to avoid a full para chance. But he probably just body presses here. Come on. Come on, Feeny. This should break. Okay. I don't think it's worth fishing for another one now. Maybe he thinks it is, but I don't think it's worth fishing for another one. Because now you're like in range of everything. And I might even be able to recover lefties out of range. You just zap cannon. And you hit, somehow, every single one, other than the one you need to miss for blunder policy. Like, what the hell? It's fine. Because Thunderbolt, I should live body press, right? I don't know. I should out, I don't know how fast this thing is. If he, if he hit like any less zap cannons, even. I don't know. Come on, he's quick, so he can't be that defensive, right? Okay, well then. I don't know. I don't know what the fuck is happening. Um, Basculin with a crit can bail us out. Um, if Hayes makes playoffs off of this, good for him. It doesn't really affect me that much. I think we'll get, like, a rematch into someone, which is, like, unfortunate, but, like, you know, he hit too many zap cannons for me to not be in this position. He brought a cool Reggie steal, I guess, but, like, he hit plenty of zap cannons to be in this position where if he didn't hit all of them I don't know what he's thinking about if I um, if I crit that's cool he loses playoffs off of that but he did okay interesting Sure. Okay. Cool. So he, he he will make playoffs off of this, which is cool. Good for him. I I I think had he not hit one or two of the zap cannons, you know, because it's a fifty percent accurate move, right? So if you hit if you go for six, you should hit three, but he hit five, and he missed one, and he needed to miss one for blunder policy. So we got the optimal route, probably the like one of the more optimal times as well. So I don't know. I don't know. 
cool set. Worked out for him. He needed to play in a very specific way to get here, so. Just, like, feels weird, you know? Feels bad. But, like, it really, the game does not matter that much for me. Um. Yeah. Good game. Cool set. Involves a lot of chances. He got a lot of the chances, so. Who am I to, who am I to judge? Another earthquake on a misclick. But yeah, GG. Um, very, very interesting prep. But it worked. You have to prep a specific way to 6 0, and he did. You have to play a specific way to 6 0, and he did. So, yeah. That is our regular season. Kind of a bitter ending, but we still finished third seed, which is alright. Yeah, but good game to Hayes. Um, whatever.